Hi, good morning, Bible Revival. Nick Renna. You know, I put this T-shirt on today, and it says faith. And I always think of Job. You know, Job is spelt like Job, J-O-B. It's right before Psalms. And everyone should read it. It's almost like a study because he suffered the most. What's intriguing about it is his trials that he went through. Here's a day when you read in Job uh, chapter one, it's God, it's the Lord talking to Satan. He, sa he goes, Satan, what are you doing here? He goes, ah, I've been all around the earth, this and that. And he goes, uh, well, I have a perfect, faithful, righteous man. The only other time I heard that phrase was with Noah, when God was so upset with the world that he wanted to destroy what he created, but he saw Noah, one man that was righteous, and he said, Noah, build the ark, etc." And his family was saved. Now here's Job. So he's a perfect guy in God's eyes. And Satan says, oh, you think so? Let me have a hand on him. And the Lord made a deal with Satan and said, okay, you could do anything you want, but do not kill him. So when you hear about the sufferings of Job, and he was unshaken. They, I don't want, it's almost like a movie. I don't want to tell you what goes on, but I kind of have to. Wipes out his family, wipes out all his successful um, monetary stuff, you know, land, cattle, wiped them out. And here's Job who suffered the most. That's why you have to read the whole story. It is intense, meaning you have to study it as if it's not easy, but the main the main meat is there where you'll understand. Wow, look at what he went through. Because I was reading my notes and it says, Job was stripped of everything but remained loyal, a man who loves God and whom God loves. And Jesus says, here on earth, I will have many trials and sorrows. Even Jesus said in the garden at Gethsemane before he was crucified the next day, said, Father, if you could take this cup of sorrow from me, almost like he was at his last human feeling of, I don't know if I could do it. But immediately he said, but thy will be done, immediately. So he did have that hesitation. And I always think of that and Job. Wait till you read Job in the Old Testament. You want an education of life? Wiped out. And you know, Satan couldn't penetrate this Job. And Job, in the chapter, talks to three of his buddies like you would talk to your best friends. Hey, you know, this is going on. So it's very human-related in its natu naturality, if that's a word. Put that in the dictionary. I'll have to call up Noah Webster to add that. But he had his buddies. And look at the conversation, the dialogue with his buddies while he's going through this. Anyway, hence... The shoes, like in Cinderella, the shoe fit. Noah was rewarded 10 times more. You know, another beautiful family, riches, the whole bit. But he never, he never, he was stable. He was unshaken. Hence the shirt, hence our talk today. So here's Job, J-O-B. What a study. And I'm going to leave you with that because of my shirt led me to all of this. And oh, by the way, if your friends aren't on Facebook, I'm on YouTube under Nick Renner because my brother Joe, he downloaded for me. He said, Nick, not everybody is on Facebook and they heard that you're doing these talks. So tell your non-Facebook friends that I'm on YouTube, Nick Renner. You know, I'm just trying to spread the word. And I know you guys are too because it's just happening. I know you've told someone that, hey, there's some Christian speaking going on. You know we need it in our country and in your own personal life. So get part of that tidal wave of love of Jesus and we'll all be fine. Okay, go. you're gonna go through trials. Wait till you read Job. Okay, take care. See ya. Bye.